Okay, so how do you fix your screen doors when they're slouching down? And uh, it's a real mess, actually. So the screen door was slouching down and it actually just kind of breaks apart at the joints and it slouched down like that much. And this, this part looked awful. And um, this part down here was just dragging on the ground and, and we have two of them. There's one back there too. So it was doing it on both of them and uh, the latch didn't line up and I'd have to lift it to cram it into the latch all the time. And also this kept getting lower and lower and I, I lowered it down and that really just started dragging on the ground after that. Another thing that we did is uh, we, we bought uh, wooden screen doors and um, you know, they were really flimsy and cheap ones and they slouched down real fast, you know, maybe after like three or four months and it was a big mess and then we i thought oh you know i'll buy uh the more expensive ones that have like more wood on them and they should be stronger and they slouched down too and then i bought little brackets like metal brackets for all the corners and screwed them in and you know it really didn't help much and then uh so we bought these new ones that were like um i guess they're plastic yeah i'm pretty sure they're plastic or i you know originally i thought they were aluminum but i i bought them and, um, you know, the joints just aren't good. You know, all, all the little joints in there. These little joints right here, they're just not connected well. And, you know, if they get a chance to slouch down and break apart, they're just gonna do it. And there's no way around that. Um, but, you know, after going through three sets of screen doors, I finally realized this thing, it's, it's called um, a screen door brace. And it's basically got these two screws at the top and two screws down at the bottom. And then in the middle, it's got this threaded section. And as you twist this, it gets tighter and tighter and it draws the bottom of the door up. And basically when you're done, it looks like that. And you know, it just really stays in place after that, it really fixes it. See over here we've got uh, another one. This one's a little larger one because they didn't have too large. Um, but you know, it, it works just fine. So how you put this on is you thread this stuff so that, you know, it's got a little thread here, a little thread there so that you have, it's, it's on there, but you've got room to do your tightening. And you make sure that your little latch bolt is in place so that it's at the right alignment. And then you put this on and you put this first one on kind of loose uh, so that it can swing around a bit. And then you're gonna secure these two down at the top. And I, I just used self-drilling screws and um, just drilled those in. And obviously don't over drill cause like this is just plastic. You could, you know, mess it up really easy and like, you know, just over drill, screw it and you're going to destroy the thread um but then you know and then you just kind of twist this a little bit just to make it kind of tight and then check your your uh, latches and then you're done and so uh the installation time on that was like um oh geez i'd say maybe like two minutes per door is super easy one other thing about doors like any kind of door uh, you know, I have doors that I put in everywhere. Um, I would use three of these latches on every door. I used to try using two, but they have such alignment problems all the time that uh, really three is, is optimum. Uh, maybe you could even use four, I'm not really sure, but three seems to work.